Hey pretty gang, it is Jen, your exclusive start of business coach. This video in particular is brought to you by my braid hair for cash coins. Make sure you're checking it out in the description below. So I'm here to talk to you guys about the prices, okay? This is an updated version of my previous, um, you know, how much should I charge video. So make sure you're checking out that video. I'll let it slide up here, somewhere up there. And I'm going to actually leave it in the description below. Okay, so the first thing we're going to talk about is box braids, you guys. Box braids. You guys know the poetic justice braids, the braids that Janet Jackson had when she was with Mabu <laughs> Tupac. Okay. Now, but le legit and the serious thing is that you guys know that when we're out braiding hair, um, box braids that can uh, be either child or adult. So you definitely want to. When I'm saying my prices, I'm saying and up, and the and up would mean whatever your twenty to twenty five dollars. $25 differenti differential would be between um, an adult and a child, okay? So for Brox braids, my suggestion would be $80 and up. So for example, if it is a child, probably $80. If it is an adult, $100. Um, the next braids are the Pop Smoke braids, right? AKA Snoop Dogg, AKA DJ Quick, right before there was a Pop Smoke. DJ Quick and Snoop Dogg was doing it. Just so y'all can get a history lesson. For those of y'all new booty braiders who think this is legit a pop smoke. But that's what they calling it. No shade. I know RFP. So the pop smoke braids. Um, my suggestion for the pop smoke braids, again, the differential child versus adult would be $50 and up. Um, and also depending on if you are going to be using synthetic hair and um or natural hair right fifty dollars and up again a twenty dollar differential between adult and child as well as probably another additional ten dollar differential between adding hair and not had adding hair right so that can range anywhere between fifty to a hundred dollars depending on if it's a child or for adding hair if it's an adult okay the next braids the lemonade braids aka the side braids again history lesson we all brand new braid up Okay, lemonade braids, aka braids to the side. Okay, but lemonade braids, we know, made popular by Miss Beyonce. Okay, but we want to definitely look into um, talking about how much you should charge for those braids again. Are we talking about somebody who is a child and you're using their natural hair, possibly adding beads, or are we talking about an adult where we're um, adding synthetic hair, possibly? So that is going to be. Um, $75 and up. Again, a $25, $25 differential between adult and child. Also adding an additional $10 when we're talking about adding braids. So if we're talking about a child adding braids, maybe about $75, $85. And then when we're talking about an adult, we're talking about somewhere between $100 to $125, right? Depending on how small, how big, that would be up to you. Again, you guys, this is just more of my kind of suggestion. You still need to figure out what the industry is charging. You need to so need to figure figure out what you believe that you are worth and also take into consideration you know how far is this person from you are you going to be using fake hair or not and how fast you can do the person's hair okay the next braids are the um goddess braids aka two braids okay the two braids again the two braids but it's called the goddess braids hey um with the goddess braids again depending on if it's the person's real hair fake hair child uh, um, versus adult we're talking about $50 and up okay um, then the next the core more is on the most more popular side is the feed in braids okay so feed in braids um, again depending on fake hair no hair child child not adult child we're talking about somewhere between 75 to 100 dollars of course 75 on the side with the kids hundred dollars on the side with the um, with the adults then you guys will go back to the individuals but doing individuals with the knotless individuals right um or knotless box braids that can start anywhere between 125 and up because it does take a little bit more time to do knotless braids and again between you know adult child you, you can charge somewhere from 20 125 and up so you guys i hope this was helpful um again like i said this is me giving you guys my suggestion of what i believe you should be doing again check the industry and also make sure you're taking into consideration your travel time you know hair fake hair no hair natural hair all of that should be count accounted for and the time that it will take you to do this person's hair okay so you guys i hope this was helpful and i'll be talking to you guys later bye y'all